What's going on, everybody? This is your WOF Outlook and Discussion for Saturday, January 21st, 2023. And this morning, our rain threat is still going to evolve later on this um, afternoon and into the evening hours. But today, the Storm Prediction Center has issued a marginal risk of severe weather for the immediate central Gulf Coast, which does include southeast Louisiana the far extreme southern parts of Mississippi along the coast of Mississippi, Alabama, and the Florida Panhandle. And this is, um, and the reason why they issued this marginal risk, because as I was saying yesterday, as that surface low forms over the Northwest Gulf and moves northeastward um, across the um, Louisiana coastline, it's possible that from Southeast Louisiana along the extreme immediate central Gulf Coast could possibly get into the warm sector of this system. And that's where we will have a threat for severe weather this evening into the nighttime hours. And as you can see, there is a 2% threat for tornadoes here. So a tornado or two cannot be ruled out here later on this evening and also a 5% wind threat. And as we take a look at the water vapor imagery, you can see the um, scenario is unfolding just how it was forecasted to the last few couple of days, as you can see, the upper system, the upper disturbance over the Texas Oklahoma panhandle, the strong southwesterly flow that's coming um, ahead of that system. And as you can see, we still have this stalled out surface boundary across the Gulf of Mexico, which is where that area of low pressure is going to form at in the Northwest Gulf later this morning. As we take a look at the radar, you can see that showers have been breaking out across the Baton Rouge area and, in, and across parts of the extreme North Shore. Um, heading east across southern Mississippi, Alabama, it has been some steady rain throughout almost the entire night here, with just a few scatter showers here across the New Orleans area. But all of this is expected to increase as the day progresses. And as we take a look here, and um, as we take a look as the day progress, you can see the surface low here in the Northwest Gulf heading Northeast, funneling in all the moisture across Louisiana, Mississippi, Alabama, and the Florida Panhandle. And as you can see, as we get towards the evening and nighttime hours, you can see where these few stronger cells are starting to develop at in the Gulf of Mexico, just off the central Gulf Coast. And as we advance further into time, you can see as the surface low moves inland right across southeast Louisiana, this will be our greatest chance of seeing perhaps a severe storm or two from southeast Louisiana across Mississippi, Alabama, primarily in um, Alabama and the Florida Panhandle is where the greatest threat for severe weather is going to um, unfold here. And as we continue to move this out into Sunday, all of this moves up on out of our area. So yes, the threat of severe weather has been issued for our area, the immediate central Gulf Coast today as this surface low moves inland this evening. And to add insult to injury here, this same area along the central Gulf Coast here, let me go back, along the central Gulf Coast here is forecast to potentially, it could be a significant severe weather outbreak across the central Gulf Coast Tuesday, which does include the New Orleans area on eastward to Ocean Springs in Mississippi, then across Alabama and the Florida Panhandle. So this is um, another event that we will be keeping a lookout for as the days progress to see if the situation worsens or if it hopefully perhaps get better than what we're currently forecasting. So that's going to be it for this video, you guys. I will come back later on to take a look at how this rain and this system in the Northwest Gulf is evolving. So everyone, please have your rain gear ready if you're going out. Be safe and I'll talk and I will talk to you guys later.